get oh okay all right cold meeting on rules privileges and elections to order my name is karen koslowitz and i am chair of the committee on rules privileges and elections before we begin this hearing i would like to introduce the council members of this committee who have joined us today we have council member mark traeger council member margaret chin Majority, Minority Leader Steve Matteo, maybe one day. <laughs> Council Member Rory Lansman and Council Member Adrian Adams and Council Member Vanessa Gibson, who is outside now on the phone. I would also like to acknowledge Rules Committee Council Lance Polivi and the staff members of the Council's Investigative Unit, Chuck Davis, Chief Compliance Officer, and Investigators Andre Johnson Brown, Alicia Vassell, and Julius Caranda. Today, the Ruth Committee will consider two matters. First, dissolving the Standing Committee on juvenile justice and transferring its jurisdiction to the stand com standing committee on the justice system. <clears throat> and second, changes to the membership of certain standing committees. Pursuant to rule 10.20 of the rules of the city council, the committee on rules, privileges and elections can amend a rule of the council with a later vote of the majority of all council members. First, pre-considered resolution 1142 would amend rule 7.00 by dissolving the Committee on Juvenile Justice and transferring its jurisdiction to the Committee on the Justice System. The chairperson of this standing committee was removed by a two-thirds vote of all members of the City Council on October 28th 2019. This rule change requires a majority vote of all members of the Committee of Rules, Privileges, and Elections pursuant to Rule 7.70 and a majority vote of all council members pursuant to Rule 10.20. Today's second pre-considered resolution pursuant to that same power amends Rule 7.00 by changing the membership of certain standing committees as detailed in pre-considered resolution 1141. This rule change similarly requires a majority vote of all members of the Committee of Rules, Privileges, and Elections pursuant to Rule 7.70 and a majority vote of all council members pursuant to Rule 10.20. I don't believe there's anybody here from the public to make any comments. And if you have a written statement, please provide a copy to the Sergeant of Arms. Uh, before we vote, I'm going to say the changes of all committees. <clears throat> Civil Service and Labor. We're removing Andy King and replacing uh, Helen Rosenthal. Civil and Human Rights, Inez Barron will be a member, and Rodriguez, Idanis Rodriguez is being removed. Criminal Justice, Levine and Riches are being removed from the committee that has been removed. Cultural Affairs, Council Member Karen Koslowitz will be removed and replaced by Mark Joni. Education, <clears throat> Miller will be on education and King being re is being removed. Finance will be Koslowitz. General Welfare will be Holden. Immigration, we're removing Miller and Joni. Land use, we're removing King. Parks and Recreation, replacing Mark Levine and removing King. Small Business, 
Adonis Rodriguez is joining and Danny Drum is coming off. State and federal legislation, Danny Drum is going on and King is being removed. Transportation, we're adding Andy Cohn. And youth services is going to be Bill Perkins and we're removing Andy King. Unless any members have further questions or comments, I will now call upon the clerk to take the vote regarding these matters. <coughs> Lee Martin, committee clerk, roll call vote, committee on rules, privileges, and elections. Both items are coupled. Chair Kozlowitz. I vote aye. Gibson. Chin. I vote aye. Lanspin. Aye. Traeger. Adams, Aye. Matteo, by vote of six in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions. Both items have been adopted by the committee. Okay, we're good. We're going to hold the vote open. Councilmember Gibson. 